What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video. I hope you guys are doing good. So in this video, I'll be reviewing this DB Journey Ramberg 26 liter Pro backpack to see if it's worth copping or dropping. Let's jump right in. Guys, traveling is super popular right now as we've been stuck in our homes for a very long time due to the pandemic. And now that we're free, everybody is going somewhere. And if you're traveling also and you need a backpack for your adventures, it may be tough to find a backpack that does it all. So I thought I'd review this photography travel backpack I got from DB Journey. And special shout out to them for sending me this bag. So I'll be going over all the features as well as the build quality, styling, how it fits. And most importantly, I'll be taking on an actual adventure to see if it's worth copping or dropping. So let's get started with price. So the bag is going for $299 Canadian, which is pretty expensive if you ask me, as you can find cheaper alternatives on Amazon. But can you beat this bag's quality though? As I've had Amazon bags before and they didn't last very long to be honest. I will classify this bag as a premium photography backpack and the price for those is around 200 to 250 US. So the affordability of this bag is all right. So I'm gonna give price a four out of five. Let's move on to the bag's materials and features. Starting with the front of the bag, the bag has these adjustable front straps that can be used to carry tripods, skateboards, or yoga mats. And they have this durable metallic buckles, which feels very high quality. The main material of this bag is 100% recycled nylon, finished with an extra coating for durability and water resistance. On the lateral sides, the bag has these webbings made out of 100% polyester, which can be used for hooking up other things for your adventures. And the bag has this padded structure, which is DB Journey's rib cage construction, which gives protection to whatever you're carrying inside. Let's move on to the top of the bag. So on the top, we have this large fleece lined pocket where you can store quick accessible items like wallets, phones, keys, and even snacks. And it has a small separate zipper compartment if you want to put something small in there like keys. Let's move on to the sides. So on one side, it has these adjustable straps, which can be used to hold tripods or to hold your water bottle. Unfortunately, this bag doesn't come with a water bottle holder, which is quite disappointing. But if you have a water bottle with a hook like this one, then you're fine as you can just hook it on like this. And on the other side, it has this laptop holder, which fits up to a 16 inch MacBook Pro. And again, the sides has that ribcage construction for extra protection. Let's move on to the back. The back has these supportive cushion straps, which is a little bit small for this kind of bag. So I wish they're just a little bit bigger. On the straps, there is a chest strap for better stability and it's also magnetic. And it's an actually pretty strong magnet too. And there's an additional hip belt that transfers weight off your shoulders and makes the bag a little bit lighter on your shoulders. Plus they help with keeping you supported if you're moving a lot like running or jogging. Note, these extra straps do come off if you want just a normal backpack. On top of the straps, there's these hooks, which DB Journey says that you could hook up this backpack on top of their own luggage bags. Also on the back, there's a soft padding that helps separate you from your laptop. And again, the back has that rib cage construction for added cushioning. Let's move on to the bottom. So there's nothing too special about the bottom, but something to note, there is no padding on the bottom. So be careful putting the bag down, especially if you have the laptop in there as well, as there isn't a large gap between the laptop and the ground. Let's move on to the inside of the bag. So you have this large compartment lined with polyester where you can store all your camera gear. On the side, there's a compartment where you can put other stuff in as well. And on the flap, it has three separate compartments, small, medium, and large, where you can put smaller items like chargers and more snacks or things you don't want moved around in your bag. So I definitely think 26 liters is big enough to fit everything you need on your journeys. Anything bigger, I think is just too massive. So now let's talk about the build quality. I would say the build quality on this is excellent as the zippers are coated and the stitching is top notch. So I'm gonna give the overall quality of this bag a five out of five. Let's move on to the styling of the bag. So the model of this bag is a 26 liter Rambrick Pro backpack with the blacked out colorway. It has a very functional yet sleek look, which is perfect as a travel photography backpack. And something that's great about how this bag was designed is how you can unzip the sides like this, which makes it easier if you're gonna pull out your camera to take those amazing shots. And the bag has a lot of compartments and attachment possibility. So for styling and functionality, I'm gonna have to give it a five out of five. Let's move on to how it fits. As for the fit, I'm 5'8 at 170 pounds, and the bag is 48 by 30 by 15.5 centimeters, weighing it at 1.58 kilograms or 3.48 pounds. On me, it's not too big and it's perfect for my height. However, if you are shorter, it may be a little bit too big. Good thing is DB Journey has smaller variations of this bag. However, it's not the pro version, meaning you're missing out on the side strap, chest strap, and the hip belt. So overall, the fit is great. So I'm gonna have to give it a five out of five. Let's move on to the durability. So due to the rib cage construction, everything on the inside feels very safe and protected. And the water resistance coating on the bag is an awesome feature too. And like I said before, the stitch and build quality is grade A. So for durability, I'm gonna have to give it a five out of five. Next, I wanna give a short mention to the packaging of this bag, as I found it very, very cool. So on the outside, it has this beautiful mountain design. And on the sides, I think it says, your next adventure is right around the corner. And on the inside, it tells you all the different ways that this box can be used again. How awesome is that? 
so I'm really impressed with the packaging. Good job, DB Journey. All right, although we broke down everything about this bag, the only way to truly test it is by taking it out on an actual adventure. So that's why we're headed to Banff National Park to put it to the test and see how it holds up. I give him this bag a very high rating, but maybe the adventure might change my mind on certain aspects of the bag. So what are you waiting for? Let's go. Alright guys, I'm back from my trip and through everything the bag really did its job and held up nicely. So I'm not going to change anything I've said previously about the bag. So it's time for the final verdict. And the bag gets a 24 out of 25 and gets the extreme heat score due to the functionality of the bag the extra stability due to the chest strap and hip belt, the awesome sleek styling, and extremely high durability. You're definitely paying quite a bit for this bag, but overall the price is worth it. And is worth copying. Hence the DB Journey Ramwick backpack makes an awesome purchase for anyone looking for a travel backpack. And to make it easy for you guys, I'll have a link in the comments and description below. Now I want to hear from you guys. Where are you traveling to next? Comment below, let me know. It's Anthony, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.